Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So, in this video, we're going to be doing a deep dive into Hulkbuster. He is new and improved. He was recently updated, and we're going to take a look at his newfound abilities. All right, so first, we'll just uh, give you guys a look at the champion tags. He's an Avenger, of course, metal, hero, uh, defensive tank. Uh, let's go ahead down here. Now, of course, the thing that I always look at is the block proficiency. This doesn't tell all the tale for Hulkbuster and for pretty much any champion uh, that has some other way to compensate for the uh, low block proficiency, you know, the base low block proficiency. And Hulkbuster gains armor ups, which make up for that low block proficiency. All right, take a look at his synergies. Uh, the first one, launching a special attack, converts one armor up into a fury lasting 10 seconds and granting 30% attack. That's actually pretty good, especially if you don't run suicides. You got the next one here, up to 1,000 armor rating based on how low uh, Hulkbuster's current health is. All right. And then we've got engineering experts here. Uh, each shock debuff reduces the opponent's offensive ability accuracy during special attacks by 15%. I'm not too excited about that one, honestly. Then you've got enemies. It's pretty much extra crit rating, but look at the champions. See that Corvus over there. So not bad. Not a bad deal there. All right. Next one here, 6% uh, health. Uh, those are the Iron Man, more health here, and uh, finally, more crit damage. All right, so let's take a look at his abilities. Now, this is my five star. I do have a six star, and in the gameplay, we're going to be using the six star. But this is the five star because he's awakened. Uh, now, you have a 100% chance, 100%. To self-repair, uh, you basically recover health when you go below 15% health. Now, I'm not a fan of this signature ability. But as we'll see, they try to compensate for some of the weakness of these types of abilities. Because one of the problems is when you're fighting and you get that low, usually you're gone. Uh, uh, during a live stream, uh, I showed that. Uh, we were fighting uh, Nick Fury, and I was using Guillotine 2099, and she has a similar mechanic, and she's even uh, bleed immune, but Nick Fury took her out in three hits, all right? So there's a problem with things like this. You don't want to rely on him, so he does not need to be awakened, as far as I'm concerned, all right? Now, while he's fighting as an attacker, because he has an attacker and a defender mode, uh, you're going to get more attack rating based on how large the opponent is. And you're going to get more attack rating for each shock that's on your opponent. Now, when he's fighting as a defender, he enters this iron wall mode uh, that enhances his defensive abilities. You'll, you'll see a little bit more about that uh, as we go on. So at the start of the fight, he gains an armor up buff. Now, you see, this is what I'm talking about. He has low block proficiency, but he's gaining this armor up buff. So that's going to reduce the damage that he takes. Okay. Uh, it also makes him a great option for Havoc. Because of that armor up buff, the plasma charges from Havoc aren't going to stick. You know, they will do nothing. He won't even be able to gain them. All right. Um, you get two of these armor ups. If you're on attacker mode, that's Giant Buster. That's when you're an attacker. And Iron Wall, you get four of them. So that makes sense. You know, he's tankier when he's defending. All right. And here's that brought below 15%. Now, this is not the signature ability. Okay. This is anytime you go below 15%, you're going to gain an armor up. So that's kind of how they're trying to compensate. And, you know, as a defender, you get a second one. So what they're trying to do is when you go below 15% health 
and he's awakened, these armor ups will cause him to take less damage so that he has a little bit more survivability so that he can survive to heal. Now, how practical that is, um, until they change the attack values, which they've talked about, uh, you don't want to rely on that ability. All right. Now, fighting non-cosmic champions. So anybody except a cosmic champion, uh, here's what each armor up does for Hulkbuster. Gives him energy resistance, gives him crit damage rating. Okay, so he's going to be doing more damage. Uh, incoming bleed and poison debuff suffer 25% potency. Now, I've heard something where this is not working quite right um, when it comes to suicides, but I'm not sure on that. Uh, enemy attacks suffer 20%, uh, uh, negative 20% offensive ability accuracy, and enemy attacks suffer, uh, basically, they're going to crit less. Okay, that's what's going to happen. All right, now, when he is struck by a crit, he has a 60% chance. So that's a 40% chance to fail, but a 60% chance to consume an armor up buff to inflict a shock debuff. Okay, and that deals damage. 100% chance on a heavy attack to inflict a shock debuff, dealing energy damage. So lots of ways to get that shock on him. And all special attacks, 100% chance to inflict an armor break. Now, they just recently changed uh, Hulkbuster, and I was fighting with Ghost in the side quest, and I faced a Hulkbuster and got wrecked because I did not realize that. I'm not used to Hulkbuster having those armor breaks because notice it says 100% chance to inflict. Didn't say if you get hit. And that's what was happening to me. He fired a special off. I got the armor break on me. He never touched me. But then he touched me a lot. Sad, sad day. All right. 100% um, chance to gain an unblockable buff lasting one second. So basically what that means is that his specials are unblockable. However, 100% chance if you're fighting someone that can reduce it, you know, bear that in mind. It can be reduced. Uh, I didn't see anything in here that said it couldn't be reduced. All right, now here are his special attacks. Special attack one, it'll stun him for 1.5 seconds. And if you broke their block, remember you get that unblockable. So if they're blocking, you fire this special one off. As long as it's not being reduced, it's going to break their block. And all of Hulkbuster's armor up buffs are consumed to add 1.25 second duration to the stun debuff for each armor up. So what that means is you break it and they're going to get stunned for a longer time based on your armor up buffs and you can just start wailing away with some heavy attacks. Uh, special attack two, again, if it's broken, all beam attacks have a 100% chance to inflict a power burn. All right, draining one bar of power per hit and inflicting direct damage proportional to the power drain. So if you wait until they have three bars of power, fire off this special two. Now that can be dangerous because you want to hit them when they're blocking. And a lot of times the AI, if it's blocking, it'll fire a special three off in your face. So it might be safer to do two bars of power and then uh, fire this off when they're blocking, okay? Um, but we're going to play with Winter Soldier and we're going to see because he doesn't have a special three active. So it's a little bit uh, easier to test this. OK. And you also have 100 percent chance. But, but, but wait, they get more. 100 uh, percent chance to power lock. All right. That is sweet. A power lock for three seconds. And then finally, the special attack three. This attack drains 50 percent of the opponent's current power. Inflicts up to three shock debuffs, more shocks. And with each having a 80% chance to activate, dealing energy damage over 20 seconds. That's pretty good. Uh, unblockable buffs triggered during this attack gain 4.5 second duration. Okay, so we're going to go into Realm of Legends and play around with Winter Soldier. And let's see how the new Hulkbuster looks. 
All right, let's dive into Realm of Legends. You notice that I went in here with only Hulkbuster. No synergies active. We just want to take a look at him. I am running suicides, so bear that in mind uh, when you're looking at his damage. Uh, he does not seem to be very suicide friendly, but you know, we could be wrong. So first thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna try to build up to a special uh, three. Uh, notice that I am in here with my six star, as I mentioned I would be. Uh, so we just don't have the uh, heal in the end, but we don't care because we're not trying to uh, have our health that low. Okay, so just gonna build up to this special uh, three. He didn't take a whole lot of damage from that special uh, two from Winter Soldier there. All right. All righty. Okay, and then you see I have uh, the unblockable buff. Whoops, it wore off. All right, let's uh, see what his special one does. See if we can get him to, uh... yeah, now he wants to be aggressive. We want to wait until he's uh, blocking. Come on. Okay, he don't want to block. Okay, there we go. No, nope. he don't want to block. Suddenly, he doesn't want to block. Most of the time, Winter Soldier is very passive. But now, he don't seem to want to block. Okay. Uh, let's try to get to, okay. See if we can get him to do that. All right. Let's try and do this. All right, there we go. There it is. All right. It didn't seem all that. Let's get some uh, shocks on him here. I mean, his damage is definitely better than it used to be, for sure. And I'm not playing him the way he should be played, just so you guys know. There we go. You got to see all that power drained. And he was power locked for three seconds. All right. Get some shock on him. Okay, come on. I like that special uh, too. And his crits are not that bad, considering this is a tank, you know? There we go. Some more power draining. Not bad. Not bad at all. Um, I do need to play around with him a bit more. Okay, there's that stun. Didn't last long enough for me to really do anything. Alright. We get to that special two again. Nope, he fired off his special. Alright. Let's see if we can get him to do it again. Alright, there we go. I do love the fact that uh, you can power drain like that. That is pretty slick. I like it. Right. Yeah, this is not uh, the best way to uh, fight with him. Um, but I did want to see, just playing around with him, I wanted to see his um, abilities here. Okay, not too bad, not too bad. All right, uh, let's do that again. And this time we're going to try to uh, utilize a proper rotation for a uh, Hulkbuster. Okay, let's go back in. And this time I'm gonna try, try to uh, do a little heavy spam. Uh, we're not gonna worry about the special three or anything like that. Uh, this time around, it's all about that uh, special two. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, build up to the special two. Alrighty. When a soldier can be fun sometimes, the AI is a little 
weird at times. Okay. Come on. Yep, I was blocking, but he fired off that special anyway. All right, come on. There we go. And that's how you do it. All right, so then we want to try and get some more. Uh... There we go. Drain it again. More heavies. Heavies. Look at those crit numbers, though. That's what I wasn't doing uh, the first time. All right. Let's see if we can do that some more. Yeah, he's happy to get rid of his uh, specials now. Ah, messed up. Wasn't expecting him to do that. All right. Okay, there we go. Just look at that, man. That is some damage. Whew. That is fun. That is a lot of fun. Yeah, see? He fires his special off. He's not being as passive as he uh, normally is. That's okay. There we go. Oops. Timing. Ah, come on. All right. We messed up on that one, but it's all good. Let's do it again. All right. There we go. Mm-hmm. Get in that corner. Stay in that corner. Mm-hmm. Good times. Good times. All right, let's try and do it one more time. All righty. Okay, I don't know why he didn't do a heavy, but we got him down. All right, so that is a better showing of Hulkbuster. All right, hope you enjoyed this video. Click like, subscribe, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about the video and the new Hulkbuster buff. Uh, I think he's worthy of a rank four easy, possibly a rank five, but definitely a rank four. If you have uh, tech rank up gems or anything like that, he's a good candidate for it. All right, so take care and you all have a blessed day.